All right, enough is enough. Safa, pay the girls. It's a matter of bonuses. Yes, it is. We know that FIFA pays an appearance fee at the World Cup. Pay the girls. We've done this with Banyana Banyana. You've done this with Bafana Bafana. And you're doing it with Banyana Banyana again. Now, that is the reason why Lamini is not playing. Africa's best goalkeeper. There's no way Desri Ellis, the coach of Banyana Banyana, is going to put Lamini on the bench for two whole matches if there's nothing politically wrong. There's something political going on. Management, Safa, up top, you are interfering. Stop interfering. You've done this a lot of times. We, as the, as the people of South Africa, are saying, support these girls, pay these girls what they deserve. Gone are the times where people have to be treated like slaves. They have to be treated like cattle. They're treated like with no respect they know their rights and they are well within their rights to strike if they strike but you as management should deal with this in a way that will not get out and in a manner that's not in a manner that's not obvious and in a manner that does not oppress people these girls should be paid what they deserve now that we just saw that sweden beat italy 5-0 the window of opportunity is open. All we have to do is to win the next game. Banyana Banyana should win the next game. Beat Italy. 1-0 comfortably should get us through. Of course, that will depend on Sweden beating uh, Argentina, which could happen, which will happen, which should happen. So what we are saying as the people of South Africa is this. We are behind Banyana Banyana. So go Banyana Banyana. We are behind you. We love you. We support you. We respect you. And we are with you in this fight. You should be getting paid what you deserve. So Safa, do the right thing. Pay these girls their bonuses whatever is worth pay them their bonuses we do not want to see these girls suffer we do not want to see these girls end up like the yesteryear players who are now without funds and without any support from Safa or the government so that's what these girls are trying to do with their strike they're trying to avoid being in a situation where they retire because soccer is a very short career and the women football in general does not pay much. So you as Safa have to wake up, find the funds wherever they need to come from. We already know that FIFA is giving Safa money to pay the players, their appearance bonuses. We know that already. It's not a secret. So if a player is going to, is going <clears> to, <throat> if a player is going to bring it up with the coach and management that they should be getting paid before even playing, then they're well within their right to even inquire about it. So that's where the problem is. Safa does not want to pay these girls what they deserve on time. Perhaps the plan is to pay them, but on time. Pay them on time. Per diem is not enough. <clears throat> Allowances and stipends are not enough. Pay them what FIFA told you to pay them. Can Petris Mutsipe, the president of KEF, also get involved in this, please? Because our, our teams, our country is struggling when it comes to sports, when it comes to soccer, more, 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 uh, especially. We're suffering. Only because of these little technicalities. So please pay the girls what they deserve. What is rightfully theirs. Ayanda Lamini is Africa's best goalkeeper. She must be playing. Nobody else should be playing that position. It's hers. She must be playing. She's the rightful person to play. It's a, if it's a matter of attitude, then the coach will deal with the player's attitude the rightful way. Desri Ellis is well uh, experienced and equipped to be able to deal with uh, a problematic player. The right way. The, the way that does not hinder our play on the field players feel comfortable when they know that they have a good goalkeeper so the team becomes stable the team becomes stable the defense becomes locked tight air lock tight that's what we need air lock tight because we don't have a problem up front the girls are scoring goals they're representing our country we are proud of them every single match they play they bring dignity to south africa so please pay Banyana Banyana what is rightfully theirs. These girls are the best. Thank you.